Uh, nagsimula na nga po kanina sa ASAP ang uh, special na wedding uh, details. Uh, uh, iba't iba pong um, wedding special announcement na mapapanood nyo sa iba't ibang um, platforms oh, okay. uh, ng kapamilya sa mga iba't ibang shows po. Lilibot po sila Richard at Sarah. May iba't ibang mga interviews sila including sa iba't ibang... <coughs> Yeah, programs ng ABS-CBN. So, uh, okay. Siyempre, maraming nagulat, uh, Charles, uh, Sarah, kasi kahit sa press ko na to, ang sabi ng uh, corporate communication, special announcement, medyo inilihe. <laughs> Times in October, di ba, ang ASA. Talagang sobrang pinag-usapan. Uh, we're very thankful, siyempre, sa ABS-CBN nga, um, uh, headed by Ms. Cory Bidanes. And when we spoke to her about this and she got very excited and she sinabi niya agad na, okay, let's announce it, let's do this. And then, nung pinresent sa amin kung ano yung gagawin execution, talagang na-excite kami ni Sarah. And we're very thankful for all the hard work and uh, for organizing everything. So, well, pati kami na nagulat sa, sa setup. And we're very thankful also sa ASAP na ang ganda nung, ang ganda nung opening, ang ganda nung no setup na ginawa nila for us Valentine's in October. Ayan nga, we're very grateful to um, ABS-CBN, to our bosses, and to our ASAP family, and to the singers na kumanta para sa amin kanina sila, Kuya Martin, Kuya Ogi, uh, Moira, Jason. It felt like a wedding kanina. So, super grateful and <laughs> practice for our wedding. But, um, kasi we made it official to our parents, to the kids, to our friends. So, parang we wanted to make it really official sa supporters namin each other and announce it properly. So, today is a special day. And Shepard, may palang congratulations. So, Aaron, sismulan na natin ang Q&A. Yes, for sure. Shepard, yes. Okay, our first question will come from the Dean of Entertainment Journalists, no other than Manay Ethel Ramos. Happy Sunday, Manay. Hi, Manay. Hi, Manay. Gusto kong itanong, why only now after two kids? Um... <clears throat> Dapat po yan, uh, medyo na-delay po kasi um, ang totoo niyan, we were really supposed to get married earlier but then nagkaroon ako ng, ng TV series na lalo na sangre so sobrang naging busy ako so we had to postpone it and then after lalo na sangre, Sarah got pregnant again <laughs> so na-delay ulit so ngayon finally, you know, um, stable na kami you know, si, si Kai one year na, one year and a half na and uh, we feel like it's really the right time. So, it's an imperfect opportunity for us to get married. Yung marriage ba, yung wedding will take place here or in Switzerland? Dito po, dito po sa Pilipinas. Saan? Sa Forbes? Hindi, sa St. Anthony Church to To follow na lang po yung venue kung saan. Pero dito lang po sa Manila kasi um, originally, we were considering it um, in Switzerland or somewhere you know outside of the country. Pero we realized that namin na we want all our families and friends to be there. Um, malaki yung pamilya, yung side ng pamilya ko dito sa Pilipinas. Malaki din yung side ng pamilya ni Sarah dito. And ang hirap ilipat lahat. You know, hindi namin may invite lahat. So we figured na we'll have a celebration here. Nakasama namin lahat ng mahal namin sa buhay. Uh, Sarah, before I give the microphone to Salve Asis ng PM, uh, gusto kong itanong sa'yo, is, was, is, or is, ano, boy, first boyfriend mo ba si Richard? Um, first, serious. <laughs> may, may, may hindi pa naman siya. <laughs> Kasi at a young age, I was focused on my work, I was focused on growing up and uh, discovering myself, so I didn't really spent much time dating around and um i was i i'm the type na gusto ko if i'm gonna be with someone long term so i you know when i met chart i felt like it was yun na yun he how was the were, one how, how old were you then um 18, diba? 18. i think i was 18. yeah ikaw richard siyang first ano mo or Pwede kang mag-inumerate. 
Manay, parang sa ibang press code yung enumerate. <laughs> Oo nga. Um, basta si Sarah na iipa sa lahat dahil siya, siya lang yung minahal ko ng ganito and siya lang yung nag, nagpasaya sa akin ng ganito. Thank you. So, Ito si Salve Asis. Pero uh, before Salve, Manay, okay, uh, actually, uh, uh, starting uh, kanina sa ASAP hanggang sa March uh, next year, unti-unti uh, uh, po yung detalye eh, tungkol sa wedding, sa magiging wedding sa March uh, 2020. So, abangan po natin sa iba't ibang show ng ABS-CBN yung announcement. So, isa sa mga shows dito, uh, dahil uh, hanggang March pa nga, mapapanood po, ano nga ba yung mga detalye mm. ng kasal? And hindi lang sa mga shows, June, uh, pati sa iba't ibang platforms yeah. ng ABS-CBN. Yeah. Multimedia platforms. Uh, Napakabong ka. June, best yes. man ka ba? Uh, <laughs> hindi po, kasi hindi ba naman po ako man talaga. <laughs> Kakaloka. Tira ka. Ay, ito si Sam. <laughs> Parang lolo na ako, no? Okay, Sam, very. <laughs> Ay, Sarah. Hi, Char. Ah, uh, Saras, ngayong dito, dito yung sa, yung sa wedding preparation niya, mapapanood ka rin ba namin sa mga shows ng ABS-CBN regularly? Um, well, if there's an opportunity uh, that's meant for me, then why not po? But si Char muna is uh, doing a show and a movie, so si Char muna. Char, can you ano, share kung ano yung mga gagawin mo? As I from doon sa kasama sa Lavea. Yes, um... Bigla nga nagsabay-sabay yung trabaho ko recently. Um, totoo nga when it rains, it pours. So, I'm, I, st I just started, we just started uh, our uh, teleserie um, with Bea and an ensemble of cast. And then we also simultaneously started our movie for Star Cinema with Angelica and Bea. And then... Um, wow. I'm doing MMK now. It's airing on Saturday, so abang ang puli niya. Uh, and then, yun, so medyo, medyo busy this time of the year. And then, sabay pa sa wedding preparation. So, I, I have my hands full for, for the next few months. Mm. At kasama rin si Chard sa ASAP in Rome. Oh yes, mm -hmm. ASAP in Rome. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Actually, Salve, kakagaling na ni Richard kanina sa taping ng MMK, second day. Tapos tonight, magtitaping ka ulit, no? Yes, yeah, so, yeah, so oh. last night, um, well, kanina umaga, <laughs> um, second day namin, and then tonight, yung last few scenes for MMK with Elise Hossa. Okay, yes, June, okay. ang susunod na magtatanong ay naniniwala sa forever at plan na rin magpakasal. Walang iba kundi ang napaka-inlove ngayon na si Michael Bix Almasan of Bix Buzz. <laughs> Valentine's in October. Hi, ah, congratulations. Ah, paano binago ninyo na sa isa-isa? Pananaw ninyo pagdating sa pag-ibig? Parang it comes natural eh, when you're when you're in love and when you love a person. Parang it's natural that your good qualities will come out, and at the same time, when your relationship is tested, parang you discover more about yourself and you discover more about your partner. And I think having a relationship is really, you know, it's it's not it's not easy, but it's very rewarding once you find the right person. About you, Sarah. Um, with Chard, katulad ng sinabi niya, uh, pareho kami nag-grow. Uh, I grew so much ever since I uh, first knew him. Marami siyang tinuro sa akin. And um, we just keep growing together as a relationship, as parents, as individuals. And we, um, we cherish that. We cherish what we have. We... Um, what he said. Curious <laughs> naman ako nung nagsama kayo sa teleserye. Ano yung unang impression ninyo sa isa't isa? Ako, akala ko kay Chard, seryoso, tahimik. Akala ko nung una, medyo suplado. <laughs> Pero hindi naman pala. Nung nakilala ko siya, doon ko nakita kung gaano siya kabait na tao, kung gaano siya uh, kagaling makisama kahit kaninong tao. Um, 
kung gaano siya mapagmahal sa pamilya, sa kaibigan, um, kung paano niya tinrato yung parents ko, ako. So, talagang uh, first impressions are aren't meant to be judged by by whoever's you know, judging. <laughs> Nagkamali ako. About you, Chad? Anong unang impression mo kay Sarah? Sarah, um, feeling ko rin ano siya, parang yung, kasi she was born in Switzerland and then she speaks French, syempre, so parang feeling ko parang out of my league, you know, or yun nga, may pagka reserved or suplada. Pero once na nag-band na kami dun sa set namin, parang I realized that we have a lot of things in common. Yung, yung mga adventures na hilig niya, hilig ko din. And then, you know, I got along. Uh, kasi nabanggit mo lang kanina na siyempre inumaga ka sa taping ng MMK. Pero maraming nagulat uh, kasi nagsayo ka again with uh, Sarah. Ilang years ka rin bang hindi nagsayo? Nabitin nga ako oh, sa sayo niya. Talaga. <laughs> sayo ba yun? Parang gumalang gano'n lang ako. <laughs> Pasway-sway lang. Papapayag ka pa rin ulit. Oo, siyempre. Well, it's a special day, of course. So, you know. Um, nung sinabi sa akin na... Well, Sarah... Sarah was kind of convincing me to also do that. And I gave in. <laughs> Pero, yun nga, I, I figured naman, as up, you know, they have a great team. You know, G-Force. Mr. Cell was there guiding me. <laughs> Sarah. As if naman ang hirap ng ginawa ko. <laughs> Pero, um, yun nga, it's the first time again. You know, every time I step on the ASAP stage, sobrang kabato ako. Parang it's nerve-wracking for me every time I step on ASAP stage. Kasi nga, parang it's really out of my comfort zone. Um, but I was happy na nandun si Sarah. She made me feel relaxed. And the entire ASAP team was there, so, yeah. So, may mas matinding dance number before the wedding, so much? <laughs> si Sarah kasi dun sa video, sinabi niya mahilig daw ako sumayaw ngayon. Puro sayaw na ang offer sa akin ng ASAP. <laughs> kumanta, sabi niya kumanta din. Tsaka kumanta daw. Totoo naman po kasi, hindi na kayo ng tao. Huwag ang ulitin. Ang tanong po kasi sa akin sa ASAP BTR, ano yung mga hindi alam ng tao about Chard na hindi pa namin nasa-share? Si Chard, mahilig talaga siyang kumanta at sumayaw. Talagang siya. Oh. Ano ulit ngayon? Sa kanilang lahat. Sa Sa Saan yun? Saan? Huwag na, huwag na. Okay na yung panahon. Baka huwag na. Meron ako din isang recording ni Chard. Pero eto ah, ang next na magtatanong, syempre isang kinikilig sa inyo. Grabe. Eto ka, Philippine Star, nakalito mga ba? Congrats again and... My question is, um, kailan sa March exactly, and is there anything special why you chose March as a wedding month? Um, we chose we chose March because we got engaged in March. Kai was born in March. Zion April, pero malapit sa March. <laughs> March is a very special month for us, so we felt March would be right to get married. Parang everything aligned. When we were checking the dates, when we were checking availabilities, you know, everything, parang everything aligned for March. So, so you know, we decided, you know, let's do it in March 2020. Uh, 2020. Yeah, 2020. Uh, my, uh, my next question, um, how was the wedding preps? How are you dealing with the pressure of the wedding preparation? Well, so we kind you. of, I uh, know, um, ironed a lot of things already. <clears throat> Pero syempre, maraming pang kailangan i-finalize. Um, you know, it's not easy pala preparing for a wedding. Ano? Pero we're happy na maraming tumutulong sa amin. You know? And magaling yung wedding organizer namin, si Amanda Tirol. <laughs> Shout out. Um, so, yun. Um, we're kind of like, so far, okay, okay naman. Yung smooth naman. We still have enough time to really iron things out. Pero parang si Sara yung mas hands-on sa preparation. I think we've covered 50% of the organization and the planning. Um, next month, I'm picking up my dress. And um, we're working on the small little details na lang. So yan, mawawala sandali si Sara. Kukunin niya, di ba? Uh -huh. 
Pero yun nga, kaabangan natin sa iba't ibang shows ng ABS-CBN, yung eksaktong data uh, and platforms. Oo, oh, oh, oh. and platforms. Hindi <laughs> ko makabisado. Pero eto, may, may tanong pa rin si Natalie. Yeah, kasi nanood kami ng BTR, pwede can you just go back to that proposal? Kasi you were, so you were quoted as saying, Shara, that you, that it was unexpected. So, yeah, can you, why and can you just go back a little bit on that video? Yung araw na yun kasi, we scheduled that day because we were there for four days in Zermatt. And then, nung first, second, and third day, medyo gloomy, umuulan. Nung fourth day, lumabas yung sun, and we decided to go on a hike na hindi madali. <laughs> so, nag-hike muna kami, and then um, we ate somewhere, and when we stepped out of that restaurant, that's where he decided to do it. And that's why it was so unexpected, kasi <laughs> nag-hiking talaga kami, naka-backpack kami pareho, uh, naka-hiking boots, and... Um, it was so unexpectedly beautiful. Thank you. Sabi niya sana daw pinagsalon ko muna siya bago kami makyat. Sinakabonet ako. Pero parang it just felt like the right moment for me. And I was really planning it on that trip. Um, I didn't really have a specific date or anything. I just wanted na, na perfect yung setting. And I think the hike also kind of resembles our relationship na it's an uphill hike but at the end it's all worth it yes yeah and wala wala kang kaide idea ba sana wala talaga wala at all two years ago ba yon sara 2017 2017 oh, two years ago yeah so uh alan yan si alan ito yung ano eh pag ibig na nasubaybayan namin eh no <laughs> wala nung ano 20, 2012 pa yung una nagtambal diba yes Ano to, makapiling kang, ano, makita kang muli? Maka, makapiling, makapiling kang muli, ayun. Chad, ang um, totoo ba, kaya napunta doon sa show na yun, sa, sa serya na yun si Sarah, you requested for her, tama ba yun? Sino okay. nagsabi sa inyo? <laughs> 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 Oo, parang, ah, parang, tapos, tapos na nun stars na kayo, no? sa parang gusto mo siya makapartner, parang gano'n, totoo ba yun? Yes. Ayun. Pero sino nagsabi sa'yo? Wala. 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 Oh, I heard that before pa. Hindi, yes. So, mm -hmm. I wanted to work with her. Na. Pero, na meet mo na siya before that? Na meet ko na siya before that. Oo. So, doon pa lang na-attract ka na kay Sarah at gusto mo na siya maging leading lady. O, doon kontradi na siya noong time na yun. Si Carla talaga yung partner mo, di ba? <laughs> yes. So, so ito talaga yung unang na-inlove. Doon sa ano, nagtatalo pa kayo sa video, di ba? Well, siya, siya talaga. <laughs> Oh, pero alam mo yun, Sarah? Na, Technically, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. ikaw. Hindi ko alam eh, kasi... <laughs> Sige na nga ako. Na. <laughs> <laughs> oh, ikaw, Sarah, ano ba? Na, pero ikaw, di na-attract ka na agad when you ano, first met Char. Oo oh, naman. Diba? Oo oh, naman. Um, aside from Guapo, na-attract ako sa personality ni Char. And na, we got along so well and so fast. Na ang dami kasing ang dami naming things in common in terms of her personality, um, in terms of what we like, adventures kami pareho, scuba divers kami pareho, um, malalim siya mag-isip and I like meaningful deep conversations and um, aside from that, talagang we got along well and pati yung parents ng isa't isa, we, we got to know each other very well. Okay, medyo balikan natin yung timeline ng inyong love story. 2012 yon. Kailan ba ni naging official kayo after the teleserye? So 2012 pa rin. Yeah. And then... Parang end of 2012 na. 2012. Yeah. And then you got pregnant 2013 ba? Um, SARS? Yeah. Ayun. Tapos, yung time na yun, nagpunta ka ng Switzerland, bigla ka nawala. Meron ka pinagtaanan na matindi sa buhay mo nun. Di ba? May legal battle and all. Was there a time na parang gusto mo nang sumuko nung sa hirap na yun ang pinagtaanan nyo? Nung... Nung, anong yun, nung panahon na yun? Well, nahirapan naman talaga ako kasi iisipin mo ba naman at the age of such a young age, ang dami mong pinoproblema instead of just thinking about um, raising a healthy, beautiful boy. Ang dami kong pinoproblema. But then, I'm also very blessed and very lucky na hindi ako nag-iisa while I was going through that kasi I had charred, I had my parents, I had 
his family, I had my friends in Switzerland. So, mas mahirap siguro talaga kung ako lang yung mag-isa na pinagdaanan ko yun. Siguro, gusto ko talaga mag-evolve. But then I had them, so... So, Chad, you never left her nung mga times na, yung trying times na yun. Hindi ka nawala sa tabi ni Sarah. Hindi talaga ako na, nawala sa tabi niya. Well, physically, you know, I was here and she was there, but every day we would talk to each other, every day, you know, we would communicate. And then, maraming din nakakaalam, during that time, <clears throat> um, nagkapaalam ako dun sa teleserye ko, kasi may teleserye akong ginagawa nun. If I could do for four days, five days, pupunta akong Switzerland for four to five days, and then babalik ako dito just to see her para lang kamustahin yung pregnancy niya, and then, yun nga, pag may mga scheduled checkups with the doctor, talagang lumipad ako dun. And when Zion um, was born, I had five days in Switzerland. Kasi nga, tinatapos ko yung teleserye ko during that time. Nagpaalam ako sa producer if I could leave. And thankfully, pinayagan nila ako. And then, exacto, when I went to Switzerland, on my last day, uh, Zion was born. Nakakalungkot lang. Eh, well, masaya ako dahil naabutan ko, you know, si Zion. But then the next day, I had to leave. So, marami kami mga ganung moments na pinagtaanan na mahirap. Pero, yun nga, parang it, it made us stronger together. Okay, tapos, um, two years ago, nag-propose ka na, Chardo, nga sa Lerma. Yes. Kailan yung na-decide na um, you'll get married na ng March 20th? Ano, naisip nyo na yun before pa? Or this year nyo lang naisip na pag-decision na? Well, after the proposal, we were planning it na. And then, all of a sudden, um, uh, the Luna Sangre happened. And then, parang, we, we wanted to take our time. Parang we didn't want to rush it, di ba? So, we wanted, parang everything stable, everything is relaxed. And, and then, um, then Kai arrives in our lives. And then, so, na push back ulit yung wedding. And then now, finally, parang ito na talaga yung right time for us. Sana mas there a time na parang medyo naginip ka. Sa dami ng tatanong, kaya kayo makikakasal kay Richard. Ganyan, ganyan. Diba parang makulit yung mga tao. And we saw yun nung unang-unang kong sinuot yung engagement ring sa premiere ng isang movie mo, diba? So, na ano ka ba no? Na kakainis na yung mga tanong. Hindi ko alam kung kailan. Hindi <laughs> naman. Honestly, hindi naman. Um... Kasi masaya naman ako, we're in a very stable relationship, and I'm very stable, he's very stable, grabe yung una unawaan namin sa isa't isa, so um, unbothered naman ako sa, sa ganong bagay dahil alam ko, you know, in God's perfect time, darating talaga kung kailan dapat mangyari yun, so hindi naman masyado. Mm -hmm. Tapos, birthday mo na sa Wednesday, di ba, Sar? Ikaw din. Yeah. Happy birthday. <laughs> Thank you. O, tapos, uh, so ano, may plans pa kayo for your birthday? O ito na ba yung birthday gift na hinihintay mo for, for this year? Of course, um, ang daming blessings this year for for me, for all of us. Um, but, I'm I'm happiest when we, we're just all together, kompleto kami, and um, uh, dinner kami. That's that's how I want it. Simple but meaningful. Thank you. Si Jerry, may tanong. Sige, sige. 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 Sige, sige.